How are you guys doing? Yeah. It's nice to be here on the internet. <laughs> Whatever we're doing. <laughs> My name is uh, Pierre Novelli. Uh, let's just explain that. <laughs> Get it out of the way. Uh, Pierre is a French first name, Novelli is an Italian surname. I have an Italian French name because I'm from South Africa. <laughs> yes. And I grew up on the Isle of Man. <laughs> so it's another one of them. Another one of those Isle of Man, South African, French, Italian stand-ups <laughs> that you get now. Uh, yes, I went to a weird school on the Isle of Man, uh, one next to the airport. It looks a bit like a castle. Um, and what was weird was that Jeremy Clarkson used to have a house down the road from my school when I was there. And what was more fun about this was that Jeremy Clarkson's house had a public footpath which ran across it, right past his kitchen window. He was upset by this. <laughs> Jeremy Clarkson sued the Isle of Man government, I think, two or three times to try and get it shut down. He lost two or three times. <laughs> because people just kept walking their dog right past his kitchen. Now, that's already funny, because it's annoying Jeremy Clarkson. That's enough for me. I'm already enjoying myself. But there's more. Half of my sixth form was German. I don't know why. I don't know how badly you have to fuck up in Germany to be sent to the Isle of Man. <laughs> <laughs> to be educated. <laughs> you fingered the cat for the last time. <laughs> I don't know. But we got those kids and they love Jeremy Clarkson over there because of the Nazi jokes, right? Because in Germany that's a pretty fucking punk rock thing to do. Because all of their parents disapprove of making jokes about that part of their history, but the kids are like rebellious. So Clarkson is like a kind of gross, weird, car Sid Vicious to them. And the Germans loved him, and what they'd do is they'd sneak out of school and go sneak along that footpath and just try and see if they could bother Jeremy Clarkson <laughs> and loom in his kitchen window and peer in. Now, I'm already enjoying this because, again, it's annoying Jeremy Clarkson. That's, that's enough for me. But what I like even more is that because of why they liked him, there was nothing he could say to offend them or to get them to go away. <laughs> Fuck off, you bloody Nazis. Oh, Jeremy, say it again. <laughs> <laughs> what would mother think? <laughs> Thanks very much, guys. Enjoy the rest of your friend. Cheers. Piano Belly, everybody! You can catch him 9.45 right here at the Pleasance every day until the end of the Fringe or the end of time, whichever ends first. <laughs>